I don't have to tell you uh, what you mean to all of us here um, and to uh, not only all of us here, all of us in the United States, around the world, um, for what, not just for uh, what you've done, but for who you are and what you have done for charity. Monty Hall has raised more money for charity than anyone else in the world, and thank you for that. Um, I want to thank Hillary and the uh, Los Angeles Jewish Film Festival for this. Uh, does that mean I have to start, stop achieving or can I still achieve some more? <laughs> I'll go on achieving. Um, you know, it means a lot to me, especially uh, because uh, I share this with my family uh, that's here tonight, my lovely wife, Ziona, my sons, uh, and my granddaughter. Uh, who had to run home because it's late, but uh, I, I am uh, truly grateful. You know, awards are, are wonderful, but uh, it, it is so meaningful because I have so many friends here tonight that have come uh, to share this with me as well, and um, I'm, very, I'm very grateful. And, you know, it's when I see this film, uh, you have to remember that when we did this film, you know, the conditions, and, and my dear friend Adam Greenberg, uh, who shot the film, can attest to that. Uh, in 1966, there were about three million people, citizens in Israel. Uh, w half the population saw this film when it came out. There was no television, and it really uh, has become uh, you know, uh, something of a legendary uh, achievement uh, in Israel. As you see, uh, the greatest actors uh, of the time in Israel are in this film. Unfortunately, except for one or two, they're all gone. Uh, Aaron Meskin was the Lawrence Olivier of, of the Habima. Um, he played the father of Kuni Lemel. Shmuel Rudensky, uh, who played the girl's father. Raphael Klatchkin, the matchmaker. These were great, great, great stars. And when I was told that I'm going to be working with these people, I just couldn't believe it. I was a little pisher. <laughs> I was 19 years old. But um, it's, it really started my career in Israel. And since then, uh, I've been Kuni Lemo. <laughs> and no matter what I've done and no matter what I've accomplished, Wherever I go, if it's here or in Israel, uh, they tell me that they grew up on me and I'm Kuni Lemel, so I guess I'll be Kuni Lemel forever. 